Yeah, our friends Madison and, and Cameron were are still up there. And Sydney C got moved back because he, she had to change her name. <laughs> that sounds suspicious. <laughs> no, you didn't change your name. It's just on the ticket. On the ticket, it was printed out wrong, and she had to reconfirm it. Yeah. So yeah, never really bring it up. We're about six hours into the flight. Yeah. Here's what the map looks like. You still got a while left. Six hours. Cool. Hey guys, it's me, Ryan. And today is the day after I arrived in Japan. So it's been a very fun and interesting few, well, two days so far. The first day was kind of awkward, but you know that's that's fine and it's what and it's to be expected. But uh, today I think I completely broke the ice with my counterparts, and that's really really good. And uh, uh, I wanted to post last night and or maybe earlier throughout the day, but really we've been talking so much that I haven't had the chance to. And we can we can actually have like long long conversations because I know a little bit of Japanese and he knows a little bit of English. So we can kind of use that to speak to each other and very, we don't have to use like Google Translate a lot because we, because we both speak a little bit of each language. Uh, so we only have to use Google Translate for like complex, for complex sentences when we're trying to communicate to each other. And uh, I just, we just finished uh, actually eating dinner after I showed them some magic tricks and they were, they were surprised by those. So that was pretty cool. And then after that, uh, his mom is a yoga instructor, and she helped me straighten out my twisted pelvis. Uh, it was weird. She had a, a model of a pelvis in her in her room, and so I decided to tell her about my twisted pelvis, and she actually she helped me heal my pelvis by doing yoga stretches. And that's also cool because we got to like show off her flexibility, and I got to stretch with her. And so I like stretching, and I know my dad said that, like, not to stretch in Japan because it wouldn't be natural but like now but she seems like she's okay with it and I think I think that it'll be okay because you know she is a yoga instructor and she likes to she she likes to like do yoga and in yoga you need to be flexible so you stretch um, and so today uh, also we just uh, f two hours ago I think it was we just got back from the uh, from giving our presentation, and we met, we met uh, Takako again, and uh, yeah, it was a nice ceremony, and we got to meet everyone off on the staff of the uh, Hameji Committee, so that was fun, and we we got to have some wonderful food while we we're there, and we took a lot of photos, and all the photos are like, so that's it's really really cool, yeah, and I got a lot of school photos and. I got a lot of school photos with like um, the students at his school and this is it's been a really really fun time so far and I just hope I look forward to great things and I think that good things will start happening from now on so yeah I'll post another blog later later throughout the week bye